Over half of all Americans participate in Valentine's Day. But this morning, the Better Business Bureau wants to warn consumers about uh, some scammers who may attempt to make it on your list of gift recipients via a romance scam, scam or um, on an online dating site. Here to tell us more about it, we have got Sean Rose with the Better Business Bureau. Okay. So we're talking about romance scams. Yep. Tis the season since yep. Valentine's Day is just next week, so mm -hmm. almost Absolutely. a week away. Um, so this is more about online dating, though. Right. Yeah. So and I mean, it, it definitely uh, it manifests itself in different ways, whether it's like an app or an online website or something like that. But it's kind of becoming more and more prevalent and something we want people to watch out for. Yeah, because a lot more people are um, going to online dating sites mm -hmm. in order to meet their partner. So exactly. so what's happening on there? So basically, what happens is you know somebody will you'll match up with somebody and you'll start talking to them and they'll be just amazing and phenomenal and then they'll start talking more the and more perfect to match. Yeah, absolutely. It's like Cupid's arrow struck and all that. And uh, <laughs> Then one day they'll be like, oh, I'd like to come see you or, oh, I'm having problems with the family or something. And because, you know, you've grown attached to this person, you want to go and help them. So you'll send them money and then you'll never hear from them again. Oh, yeah. so you go and meet them and they're never to be found. Exactly. You get... Ditched. Yeah, it's almost and like you get your money. getting catfished, but without the catfish. You know? Oh man, yeah. so that is a horrible one. So how? I mean, how can you protect yourself? How could you possibly know? Absolutely. So the first thing you want to do is kind of be aware, um, do your research. Like if they have one profile pic and you're like, this picture's too good to be true, Google reverse image search on it. Uh, look at the details on their web on their profile and see what all they say, and then start talking to them about it and asking them. Oh, so you know. I saw you're a grad student, and how's that, and whatever, you know. That way you can kind of tell and make sure that they're like a real person mm -hmm. or that they're, they're not just some fictitious person. The other good thing is watch out how they communicate. Um, if they are like grammar problems all the time and you kind of start to tell maybe it's not their native language, it could be somebody overseas trying to scam you there. Yeah, that would be a telltale sign, I would yeah, think. Yeah, a little bit, you know. Sometimes you see those photos of people, too, when you're like, there's no way that yeah, this is their... Yeah, absolutely. It's like a modeling <laughs> picture, and you're like, no, that's yeah. not you. Yeah. yeah, like an underwear modeling picture, too, at that. Um, <laughs> so how does the Be Better Business Bureau help um, us to guard ourselves against some of these romance scams? Well, some of the best ways we can do is we have that scam tracker website. So you can go on there, file a report, and then anybody in the state can go and look, and it's an interactive heat map of wherever you are in the U.S. and you can see like almost down to the zip code how many scams are going on in that area, who's reporting them, and what which ones are live, how much money people lost, stuff like that. Are so. we having some of those that, that we're just talking about here in Oklahoma? Romance scams? Yeah. Um, I haven't seen any yet, but now that we're like right in February, we're almost a week away, I don't doubt that they'll start popping up. Okay, so yeah. that means be careful if you're doing online dating. Just know who you're talking to if you can. Absolutely. <laughs> at all possible. Do all the precautions. Mm -hmm. And if you want to get uh, more information about the Better Business Bureau, go to oklahomacity.bbb.org. You, you can also call them at 405-239-6081. Just let them know if you've been scammed. That helps them out so mm -hmm. they can put that on their, their tracker online. Uh -huh. And we'll be right back.